Hello, this is Jeremy with Access Innovations, and in this video we're going to look at some of the new features that come with the new Unicode formatting in version 3.7 of Data Harmony. What is Unicode? Unicode is a computer industry standard that enables software to go beyond the traditional characters on your keyboard and represent a complete set of over 107,000 characters serving virtually all written languages as well as special scientific notation. So what does this mean for Data Harmony? You can now view several different languages and character sets at once in your thesaurus. You can choose the language you want your user interface to display in the software. The new format allows for fewer conversion errors when importing and converting files. The import module in Maestro identifies and converts characters not in the UTF-8 format. Now, let's see how this looks in the actual software. Data Harmony is available with the standard English interface and now in other language interfaces as well. When you load up Data Harmony's Maestro software, the first thing you'll notice is a new drop-down menu for language on the intro frame. Selecting a language from this frame will change the language that the user interface appears in. We have English, French, Arabic, and Spanish, and we are currently working on adding additional languages. We're going to select English here so I can show you some of the other features that come with this new formatting. I mentioned earlier that you can now view several different languages and character sets at once. As you can see here, I've loaded a number of different character sets into the thesaurus. Here we have Vietnamese, the Greek letter Psi, Russian, Arabic, and Chinese. I just copied and pasted these from the internet, but you can also enter text with special characters directly into the thesaurus through the use of a keyboard or by importing files. The new format also changes how you import files using Thesaurus Master's import module. When you go to the import a file, you'll see that the Unicode UTF-8 format is the default format. In the drop-down menu, there are a number of other different formats to select, and at the bottom there is also the I don't know field, which you could choose if you are uncertain of the format of the file you wanted to import. When you select this field and import the file, the software will attempt to figure out what format your file is in so that it can import your file with the least possible error. So in summary, the new Unicode format enables you to use multilingual taxonomies or just taxonomies that include unusual terms that contain non-Latin characters. This is especially useful for scientific taxonomies that contain Greek letters such as the symbol delta or scientific principles named after scientists with special characters in their names such as the Schrodinger equation. This standardization of different character sets will enable you to have more accurate document indexing and retrieval because Data Harmony is now able to use and recognize these special characters.